please put your hands together for the very, very talented Andre Aruda, everybody! This is gonna get weird. <laughs> uh, I know what you're thinking. The answer is yes. I am Portuguese. Um, I thought about it. There was no one on TV like me. I mean, anyone closest to me were like leprechauns or, or Christmas elves or evil clones or aliens. I mean, they didn't even give Yoda a lightsaber until the shitty movie came out. <laughs> Ladies, or anyone here with long hair, if you have someone in your life who's willing to hold it back while you are vomiting, that is a good friend, right? Yeah. If you have someone in your life willing to hold your entire body while vomiting, that's an amazing friend. Oh, man. That was the reason why you're here. I know a lot of people have questions for me. And uh, my life changed considerably about two and a half years ago. It was about a lot after I turned 30. I woke up with my left leg feeling cold. It was as if I went to bed. And a few minutes after falling asleep, someone took my leg off my body, put it in a fridge, a mini fridge, and <laughs> took it out, and a few minutes before waking up, reattached it. And then I get a call, 7.30 at night. Hello, Andre? It's Dr. Steve. The doctor has never called me 7.30 at night, or at all, in person. <laughs> I'm looking at your MRI right now. And I've seen a blotch on there, but it's unidentifiable. It's enough to make you see a neurosurgeon. Good luck with your audition! <laughs> Six months later, I see my neurosurgeon. His name, Dr. Failings. <laughs> That's like going on an Alaskan, Alaskan cruise and finding out the sailor driving the boat is named Captain Iceberg, you know? Thank you.